Hi, Bill here, back again with another video. Today we're going to have a review of a 12 gauge Mossberg pump that we picked up. Picked this up pretty cheap, brand new, 300 bucks. And uh, I took this thing hunting and I didn't realize you can only put two shells in this thing. It's bull crap. So today we're going to have a review on how to take the plunger out, the plug, out to put more bullet, uh, more shells in it. Uh, first of all, you have to unscrew the cap, check it first, make sure there ain't nothing in there. It's empty. It's on safe. How I do it is kind of dangerous, but this is the only way I know how to do it from the previous guns that I had. Take this off. You unscrew this cap. Cap on the end of it. Right here. Then you got to pull the barrel off of these Mossberg guns. I thought it was going to be more of a pain in the butt than previous guns that I had, but it's pretty easy, really, to tell you the truth. What I do is I uh, cycle the action down, lift it back up, make sure I inspect it. You know what I mean? Safety is. You always got to have safety. Then I go get a live round. That's what, that's what I use. I mean, some people would probably do it different, but that's just how I do it. I'm not a professional about doing anything. I'm just showing you how I do things. So, I feed it up in until we start getting that plunger to start working itself up. And I already hit the top. I got stuck. Right there it is. You gotta put it, flip it upside down a little bit. Put another round in there. I'll put one, another one in there and push it up again. And you should be able to slide that plunger out of there, that plug. Right there it is. Now you should be able to hold five plus one in this gun now. And uh, there's a trick to these getting these bullets, these shells back out of here. On these Mossbergs, inside of here, there's a little little button that if you push it, these bullets will start coming back out. Well, usually do, probably have to put the whole thing back together, but they usually come out instead of cycling it right there. Push that little button on the side. And the shells come out of there. Like that. So it's fairly easy. Then all you gotta do is grab the barrel and put it back on. Like so. You gotta cycle this down and screw the cap back down tight the way it was that now the plugs out of there and it holds more than two rounds when you first buy them yeah they're nice guns though but it's just that that plug in there and we're in Ohio so they make sure that you can only have three rounds in your gun when you're shooting but I don't, I don't like it a bit so it came with the three chokes. I got a choke in there in the gun already. You got a modified, a full, and an extra modified, I do believe, in there. And here's a tool that comes with it. Put it in there. There's two little things on the chokes itself that that tool fits down in. I don't know if you can see that or not, but that tool will fit down in there and then grooves and you just spin it out of there if nobody ever knew how to take one of these out before I mean and there's two different size, sizes to this and I just put my finger in there when it's loose and just take it on out I mean it's, for, it's fairly easy ain't nothing too hard about putting a choke in or taking it out Put it back in, tighten her down, and uh, 
use a tool, snug it down a little bit. I never really snug them down. I, I don't never hawk man it more or less. If they're too hard to get out sometimes. But I do that. Give it a good little tighten. And we're ready to go. All right. This is the Mossberg review. How to take the plug out. My way. Like I said, I'm not a professional. There's probably an easier way or a safer way of doing it. That's just how I do it. And uh, I'm Bill. This is the Crazy Hillbilly Channel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, hit the bell, hit the button for further videos that we're going to have. And I'm out of here.